Hello everyone, uh, it's me, Tim. I'm here with uh, Bailey and Kate. Hi guys. Hi. Hi. Um, so we are trying a, a new little show thing. So we're going to be doing what's called a 10 minute review. So basically what's going to happen is we, um, and we are going to be timing this. So we're going to play the first 10 minutes of a game, and then we're going to review and rate the game based on those first 10 minutes. Um, if the game wants to be all cutscenes for 10 minutes, that's the game's fault. Uh, so yeah, uh, we figured it'd be fun and uh, funny. And once it hits 10 minutes, like we have to stop playing the game. And as is, we have to review it as is okay. based on that information. We are judging a book by its cover. Yes, we are. So um, this is Assassin's Creed Chronicles. Um, I'm going to start the timer whenever it seems like the game itself is starting because I don't know really what it's going to do. I'm, I guess I'll just like make new game and then we'll go from there. Um... I haven't played this game. I downloaded it for free. And, okay, I guess uh, whenever this starts up. Um, after reading this, we're going to start the timer. Uh, so this is China. It's been two years. Corrupt tigers. Uh, uh, Tumplars. Something. Sh uh, tigers. Oh, they're eunuchs. Does this, does this matter? I, I went to a eunuch strip club once. What? How does that work? It wasn't much fun. You're going to tell that story while I play the game. Okay, um, so oh, yeah. we are... Give, she carries a... Oh, Ezio. Okay, all right. So we're playing the game. Timer starts now. All right, so this is the game. And the Bailey, game. what? Uh, that was a joke, too. The eunuchs don't have... Strip clubs. Parts. <laughs> Bailey, I have to believe everything you say, because a lot of things that have actually happened to you are just absurd. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's fair. <laughs> That could have been something that like I... Like, you have to understand. Yeah. What is this box? I assume they're talking, but I can't. From? I don't, what is its purpose? I don't know what they're saying. I'm in a cage. Why continue to oh, is she one of the dancers? <laughs> She's a eunuch. She's a eunuch stripper. Yeah. <laughs> Where are her go -go boots? There is no escape from here. So, from what I understand, these games are, like, more along the line of, like, artistic platforming. Or something. Arrogance. Oh, so they're going for like the comic cutscene. This looks like deal. it's well done. Oh, it definitely looks artistic. But you know, they're uh they're already a minute in, yeah. so they've wasted a tenth of their time. Up, <laughs> oh, are we in it? Well, I think my controller vibrated a little bit. All right. Um, cool. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's like trying. Like what? Have you ever played trying? No. It's kind of like this. There's a character that's sort of like Assassin's Creed, and I, just... I like to play her, which is cool. Oh, the controls are actually like pretty similar to the regular Assassin's Creed. Oh, look at it. It's got like the little, the little ink things when I'm running. Dish. That's cool. Attention to detail. Uses a uh, parallax instead of full 3D. So there are levels rather than a full world. Wait, what? There's like the there's like the foreground and then the background and then the further background. Yeah. And scroll sideways proportionally. Huh? You I am. <laughs> oh shit! Oh. Wow. All right. Tutorials. What do you think they feel like with this? Like, oh, a person keeps appearing. I guess you skipped in this time. If you just like kept going there. Could I go in there? You went in there the first time. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it is actually. Oh, um, oh, oh shit. Oh, that's not it. That's a guard dog. You don't want to. Gave me away, little dick. I thought you were going to save the dog. No, he's just barking. He's just giving me away. Um, so I, I used to be a pretty big fan of Assassin's Creed like back in the day. Can I get up there? I played it on iPod Touch. I can't like jump. What? I can really only yeah. like fall. Oh, you played the, the iPod Touch one? Yeah. The Ezio or the Altair Chronicles or whatever? Yeah. I'm gonna see if I can get like a graphic for the timer uh, to put on screen as we're doing this. Um, Bailey, could you keep an eye on the timer? Yeah. Because I will forget to look 
So yeah, I was I was like a very big fan. Um pretty much all the way through like about Unity or so, which like is pretty recent. Um but I play Ooh, yeah, goodbye, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna go over here first and see what's over here. Ooh. Another little thing. Oh, yeah. Um yeah, I played like the first one and like the second one is still one of my favorites. Um and is I always thought of Venice. Huh? Or is that Rome? So the second one Venice was in the second one. Uh Brotherhood was in Rome. Okay. I liked I liked the second one. Uh, I the second, yeah, the second one was really, it was in, a lot of it was in, I think, Florence. Yeah, Florence and Venice. And... I just like jumping in the water. You get a higher score for not being seen by guards. Oh, you get more points for not killing people? It makes more sense. But killing people is so much fun. I know, a lot of games do that. Can I hide? How about I hide? There we go. It's still doing tutorials. Did someone text me? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. He's like... What the? There we go. I think we go. Um... I played... Yeah, I played all the ones that I could. Like, I didn't have a PSP, so I couldn't play, like, one that they made for that and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, My PSP doesn't play any more games for whatever <laughs> reason. What, did it break? Uh, my mom spilled coffee on it. Oh. And that doesn't whatever. play new games? It, like, only plays the games that it, like, has saved data on, for whatever reason. And I, and it doesn't work so on a Wi-Fi anymore. the whistle area? Okay, that was kind of weird. Oh, well. Um. And, uh, ooh. What? <laughs> She's got a foot blade and just stabbed the dude in the eyes. Oh, that's cool. Oh, and this guy's gonna, like, come and see him. Gotta hide him. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, one of the only people... I'm, I'm one of the few people that actually liked Assassin's Creed, like, Revelations and all that. Um, I like Revelations. And I... I yeah. couldn't play Unity, because... We have it for PS4. Yeah. And the copy that we have, it stops at that, like, animus loading screen thing. Uh huh. After the woman talks to you, and it hits 11%, and then it just freezes and it won't go any further. Huh. And I look at the disc, and the disc, like, physically doesn't have anything written on it past that point. Huh. Like, if you look at where the, like, where they write stuff onto the disc, it's just not there. I was like, cool, we got an unfinished Ooh, game. Oh, shit, that was cool. So, um, I played Syndicate, though. Was Syndicate good? I liked it because I could play a female character and I'm, she's really sneaky. Oh, I get it. She has like a super sneaky. Um, and there's like a there's a grappling hook. Yeah, I was told Syndicate was like actually pretty good. And you can go inside Buckingham Palace. Yeah. Which is pretty cool. I was I was told that it was very good. Yeah. And like I don't know, I saw someone playing it, and fuck. I thought it was gonna. Can I kill him? I'm confused. Do you have any like? Oh, I just have to uh, fuck me. I was gonna say, oh, I have to wait for him darts. to be over here. Hey, fuck that guy. Not enough blood. <laughs> <laughs> I thought. Well, I also I played Unity post patch. Oh yeah. After the eyes were all like. Oh, my phone locked. Eagle Vision shows a guard's patrol path. Okay. That's not orange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. More like scarlet. So I guess I just have to like drop down there and just get in that little spot. It's kind of, I, I don't know, Assassin's Creed in platforming, kind of weird. It's weird because I've played the other Assassin's Creeds, and I'm familiar with that, so... Oh, oh, shit, shit! Ooh. You got two minutes left. Oh! No, you don't see me. Yeah, yeah. Shit, what happens when he sees me? 
I think. I guess can. I die. You so you can't. Uh... I can't fight. Mm. Find your sword. Oh, is that just like I restart? All right, oh, game. You made me die in the first ten minutes. You can fight once you find your sword. Oh, I guess. Speed run. I'm speed running it. Put in the uh, little Mario Kart. <laughs> the 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 star music. Yeah. <laughs> can you? I, it feels. Like you <laughs> <laughs> Just keep hitting it, Bailey. Just keep touching it. I'm gonna get in here. You got one minute left. I th they have one minute. Yeah. One minute to impress. Turn around, guy. I wonder if they can hear it if they're like within that zone. Probably. Yeah. How much time, Bailey? You got 40 seconds left. Alright, guess maybe I can find the sword in that time. Shit. 30. I'm not even. Firecracker? Oh. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? <laughs> Run. All right, I hit him with a firecracker. 20. What the fuck is investigate? Am I being, like, sought out? I don't oh, I have to climb. 10. Okay. 9. 8. Oh. 7. 6. No, I can make it. 5. 4. I can find the sword. 3. three two, two one, 1. 0. Oh, I gotta do it. Yeah, that's the timer. All right. Um... Okay, so so that those ten minutes that was the first ten minutes of Assassin's Creed Chronicles China. Um, I liked it. I thought it was okay. It's like I don't know. It's a platformer, but it's also Assassin's Creed, which is weird. It doesn't seem like there are many puzzles. It, it there are probably more after the first 10 minutes, Bailey. We were only allowed to take in the first 10 minutes. <laughs> and the first 10 minutes had killing people, hiding bodies, and firecrackers. It was all- and whistling. Yeah. It was all we got. No Explosions puzzles. Explosions and dead people. Um... So, I don't know. It was like... Like, the whole assassination and, like, hiding bodies thing. Like, it was- it's a- it's an interesting dynamic to platformers. Which, like, you know, like, not bad. I thought the art style was no. pretty cool. Yeah, and that's another thing, is like... They were able to take in like Chinese art style and make that part of the game, like the little, the little scoots of your boots. And your blood is red ink. Yeah. Yeah. I thought that was cool. Yeah. Kate, what do you think? I liked it. You liked it. I liked watching it. It, it definitely it, the first the first ten minutes of it, uh, didn't didn't like feel bad at all. It played fine. It was like pretty fluid and. I'm sure there was more after the first ten minutes, but unfortunately, we are not allowed to take that into account. Uh, the rules are the rules. So, if I were on a scale of, like, 1 to 10, keeping in mind that 5 is average, I would probably put this at, like, a, like a 6. The first 10 minutes. <laughs> it was cool, it introduced, like, a really wide range of, of mechanics, like, pretty, right off the bat. And it was, like, interesting. I have no idea if I will continue playing it, which is another deciding factor. Will Tim keep playing the game after the first 10 minutes? Probably not. <laughs> I will put this at a firm, probably not. Would any of you guys like to continue playing it? After seeing it, I wouldn't go download it and play it myself. You would not? I would not. Okay. Not a huge okay. platformer? Yeah. I just feel like that I've seen it. It. If I, I want to play Assassin's Creed, I'll probably play yeah. it. One of the actual yeah, ones. Yeah, So, so it it's seems... Pretty. So it seems the verdict on this game is that it's not a real Assassin's Creed game. And how do you guys feel? Do you think 6 out of 10 is yeah. fair? Would yeah. you go any higher for, or lower? For a platformer, I think 6 out of 10 is fair. Yeah. Just the game itself. So, so it seems we're all pretty firm on that it's a, it's a, it's a 6 out of 10, and uh, it's not real. And none of us have any intention to continue <laughs> playing it. So, that's the 10 minute review. Cool. Thanks, guys. You're not real Assassin's Creed. <laughs>